Hey guys, this is Tolhi and welcome to Let's Play Minecraft Season 2 Part 20. Um, one quick comment is from this part on, I'm not sure how many parts, could be about 8 or so. The next 8, yeah, probably 8, 8 to 12 parts, next 8 to 12 parts are all going to be done in one large recording session, so they're not going to have much of an intro at the front of them. Um, they'll probably just be like cuts in between, um, just like at, at random points. Um, but on with the actual actual let's play here. Um, so uh, I've updated to uh, 5.4b for the mod. I think that's what I'm on now. Um, and then, yeah, I was at 4.5. So now that I've done this update, though, they they completely shun me. They're not they're not talking to me. They're not like. I enter here and they just want nothing to do with me. If I go to some of these other areas though, some of the other shops, they will still trade with me, but the main town center, they just, no one will come. Um, so if I come here, yeah, someone says they'll be right here. So I can still trade with some of the other, other farms and things, but I can't, I can't sell them anything or buy any of the main goods. So this town is kind of useless at this point then like they'll still they're still gonna build up and things but they're yeah they're they're not they're not gonna help me and I'm not gonna be able to help them um, so I'm not sure what to do a lot of people have said they want me to bomb a town and I I'm not really that doesn't sound like a fun idea to me but uh, let's turn those sounds down um, yeah, so I don't know. I I yeah, I guess if it's useless, I might want to might want to bomb it, but at the same time it's just really cool having a town right next to my airstrip right here. But I guess for the time being um just going to make this landing. There we go. Getting better at that. Um for the time being, I'm going to just leave it there and let it do its thing. Um, but we need to go find a new town. Um, so let us put the Spitfire together and we're going to use the Spitfire to go search for, um, a new town. I'm not sure exactly which direction I want to head in to do this, but, uh, I guess we'll see. So we're going to take the Spitfire and I'm probably going to want to take some materials to trade with this new town. Uh, let's go back to first person view. Uh, what do I have in the way of materials? Really, I have a lot of iron, don't I? I could. 64, 64. So, let, let me just take all these out and then look at it all in my inventory. Because, like, yeah, I could trade a town a lot of iron and that would get me a lot of money, but really, for them, they're more so going to need. Oh yeah, I forgot about all this gold. I need to finish making my booster track too. Uh, put that gold in there. 59 gold. That's really good. Okay, um, I'm actually going to put all this iron away for the time being. And I think I'll take uh, one stack with me. Uh, shovel. I need to make another diamond pick. Uh, let's do that right now. Before I forget. Actually, you know what? Just give me uh, give me a minute. I'm going to quickly organize all my inventory and uh, figure out what I want to take with me. And then I'll be back in a second. So, I am so frustrated right now that I, I, I kind of want to just stop recording and just be done. Because, see, here's the thing. Is I went and I just did an hour, two hours of recording. But all of that is rendered useless now because basically uh, I had found three or four new towns and I had started helping them build up and stuff. They had built a couple new buildings, had done some flying around and some awesome combat and just in general some I what I think was good footage. And uh, most of that's going to be null and void now because the save file got corrupted. I went to copy it over and somehow I got it messed up and now it's destroyed when I was trying to back it up. 
What type of town is this? This looks like an agricultural town. And so... Shoot, I couldn't see. Uh, and so that footage is... Oh no, that's an abbey, I think. So this must be a religious town. So that footage is 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 broken now. Just just absolutely broken. Because like I can still show it to you guys if you want, and it can be like the lost scenes or something. I don't know. But the point is, is that it's gonna be completely like I can't continue with that save file. All those villages are gone. I don't know if they're gonna spawn in the same spots now. I don't know. It just I it it's it's gone. All that it, it's useless because of the fact that I can't. I can't, I, I can't get, go from that save file, so all that footage is like a dead end, if that makes any sense, because it, it just doesn't matter, because none of it's, it, 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 it's completely useless. New town here, which looks to be another religious one, that's glitching out right now. Still, still popping into existence. Okay. Um, so I'm just flying, and I don't know. I, I don't even know what to do now, because it's like all that footage. Is, I'm still gonna release it. Is what I'm gonna do. This will still be part of the main let's play here. Um, I'm not sure how to continue though. Um, I guess I can keep trying to find more villages and trying to build them up uh, there's one village in particular that I'm not sure I if it's gonna spawn again I doubt it uh, 100 meters west that should be right in front of me yeah there what type of town is this this looks like an agricultural town I see yeah two farms I think that's agricultural um, I also changed the distance between towns before it was like every 800 meters you would find a town I've got it to set to like 500 or 400 or something I can't remember exactly but um, I've got it so villages are coming up more often snowy trees okay based on that I think Okay. Sorry, I'm just I'm trying to figure out where I am right now because I had explored most of this area, and I'm I'm not sure if it's going to be the same as last time. No, it's not. I'm in a different spot than where I think I am. Where am I? Oh no. Okay, this is where I I this is the spot. So last in the whoa whoa that was close in in the old footage a village spawned here in this exact same spot I think in in a similar spot to where this one just did um, but it was a tools town so I'm looking for um, a tools town to spawn or a military town I think not agricultural or religious let's head this way yeah, see if we can get something to spawn over here. The, um, yeah, so I'm not sure. Yeah, I guess I can continue with the trading. But the thing that I found is that villages will only be active within a certain distance. And if you have too many villages too close to each other, the game starts to lag really bad. So what I'm, I'm thinking is I'm just going to have to build up one town. Oh, here's another one. What type of town is this? Looks promising. Um, looks like another agriculture. No, it's a religious one. You can tell by the, by the building. Um, okay. So let's head this way. The nice thing about this, uh, is that with the towns, I can always find my ba way back to the airstrip because I can always just go to that first town. So yeah, I'm just really looking for a military or tool town, preferably military, because I'd like to see the fort. Um, 
I guess the the military towns are based around a fort instead of a town hall. And so I kind of want to build one of those up and see how how a military town goes. Oh. Uh, La Forge. Where's that to? East? Oh, I think I see it. It's a nice flat area for a town to build on. Oh, there's a... There's a mine. And that looks to be a town hall. Okay, so here is the best way to land a plane. Coming in. Yeah, right here. There we go. Land it right on top of the town hall. Okay, and then... Let's see. Yeah, this is a tool making town and they need wood because they're going to make... I can't remember what that one is. Okay, uh... Oh, it's getting night time though. Oh, and I didn't take a bed. It's the same mistake I made last time. Um, so I need sheep. <gasps> sheep! Yes, exactly what I need. Don't despawn or anything weird. I need your wool to make a bed. Which are two, one. Um, okay. Oh, okay. I'm. I miss saw what they dropped. Okay, so I got four. That's more than enough. So for the time being, I'm gonna take over the. Uh, the town hall and I'm going to turn that into a safe place to rest um, okay so I'm going to come in here make a bed and then seal off this area uh, let's see so turn this wood into some planks and then the wool that's a bed and then make a couple more planks to try and seal off the door with. Uh, let's do this. Okay, and then bed in the center here. And let's see if I can get some sleep. Ah, oh, zombies! Is it the windows? I've done this before. There we go. Hello. Um, I know you guys don't need any any stone, but here's a bunch of stone. Um, take this bed back. Actually, you know what? I probably should have left that there because that would have set my spawn for here if I die. Okay, well, whatever. Um, open back up the door. They're upgrading something already. Oh, I gave them enough stone. They're just going to make the... Oh! This still thing is still moving forward. Okay, well... Let us just... Smash it? No. I don't really want to... Yeah. Just smash. Did I pick up all the items for that? Yes. Okay. And I'll have to make a plane making bench soon. Okay, that stone seems to be helping them. Okay, so they upgraded their mine. That's what it was that they were working on. Um, they're going to need a forge soon. It's probably going to be their next project as soon as they're finished upgrading the mine. Let's see if we can help them with that. She just left via the window. Okay, uh... They still need all that wood. Okay, so, uh, let's... I'm gonna start gathering wood for them. Because it seems like their lumbermen are slow. What's... What's this house over here? Oh. Oh, a cow farm. That's kind of far away from the rest of the village. There's no other villages nearby, so this has to be part of the same village. Okay. Just gonna get some wood so uh, 
I'm gathering this up. I should probably get Kit to sit though, because right now he might jump in my way, my way and I might hit him and I don't really have any extra meat to give him. Um, this is actually really fast with a diamond pick. I don't think I've ever... I have to have had a diamond pick before. I just can't think of a time when I've made one. But yeah, normally I'd never bother with a diamond pick, but this is actually working quite well. For gathering a lot of lumber rather quickly. So yeah, well, I guess I'm just going to help this town and see how they grow. And, uh... See if I can get them to... See, I, I basically want to see what the difference is between the, the different types of villages. So this... This one here should grow differently than a than the village I had before because of the new updates because it's a more it's a specific type of town so it won't you won't make some of the buildings so it should fast track towards building tools and different things like that um, 64 lumber let's get a little bit more not sure how much yet though Let's get on here. Okay, and then get this lumber as well. Okay. Well, this should be a fair amount. Let's head back to the town center and give them this wood. And then see how they're good doing because their lumber, their their lumberjack should be taking out trees as well. Kid, are you... hear him whining. He's hurting himself. Okay. Uh, yeah, they only got 29 wood. Shoot. Okay, I might have to gather a lot more from them. Uh, Kit, sit. Okay. Uh, still not enough uh, wood. So, I'm going to just gather some more until they have enough, and then I'm going to see what they do. 